I'm gonna put a thousand bucks. I'll put a thousand bucks. Oh my! He's not already a There you go. Let's see it. Wow. We could do an albino. Um. Yeah. What is going on, crows? Welcome back to. It's silent now. Another video. Today, we well, read by the title and thumbnail. Big scoop. <laughs> you done did the yeet. Yeah. <laughs> I am here with Jared, and you'll see a little bit more of Jared later on in this video, but we're going to a fish store, and by the end of this video, he's gonna be picking anything he wants, a couple different things from the fish store. But first, this is your first time at the farm, isn't it? Yes, <laughs> it is. <laughs> so here you go. Um, feed whatever you wanna feed. This guy's kinda hungry, look at her. <laughs> Fuego! Hello, Rosie. There you go, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Bubba said thank you. I got a little, ah, I stubbed my toe on a rock. Oh, that hurts so bad. I got a little helper. Hello, guys, how are you? Hi, everyone. What's up, mama? A little there, a little here. Put some over there. Enjoy, you lunatics. All right, pigs eating. I'm coming, little piglets, I'm coming. That is the rock I just stubbed my toe on. There you go. You guys are crazy little munchkins. Ah, dude, my toe is messed up. Jared's over there, he's feeding the hogs while I feed big pigs. Gonna walk around all the poop. <laughs> no shoes. When am I ever wearing shoes? <laughs> Move your butt. <laughs> there you go. Here, man, go. Take a little bit of that, okay. A little mud pit, they're good. Look at that enclosure. New enclosure is coming soon. Now I really want to know, I try to feed the animals in every single video due to the fact that if I don't feed them, I get a million comments about it. Do you truly enjoy seeing the animals every single video? And if you don't exactly care to see them every video, let me know in the comments down below. I'll probably still film them every video, but I'm just curious to know. And now we do waters. And J Jared! What's up? What are you doing? <laughs> Is that a liability? Probably, yeah, probably. You found the secret candy to the goat. They love this tree right here. And apparently this is like the best chameleon tree. Like chameleons love that tree. I don't know what it's called, but as you can see, it's completely bald under here because they get all that. They can't reach up here. Right, Oscar? Oh, oh my goodness. Brothers just being brothers, man. All right, all the animals have eaten. It is now time. We're going to go to the fish store and let Jared pick out anything he wants. Whatever the guy wants. Jared, you ready to go to the fish store? Yeah. I'm going to try to scare him. <laughs> ah. I snuck around the backside of the chicken coop here, our abandoned chicken coop, where the pigs now live and stay. And that was funny. Why? Are you, where are you going? Where are you? Wrong way, dude. Dude, my homie's running through the pool section. Look at him. Look at him. Oh my goodness. Oh, whoa, he's flying. Like, oh, he just. <laughs> it was like that video of the kid that hit his head on the garage right there. You good, bro? It looks like he's good. You ready to go get some fish now? Let's do it. All right, let's do it. We are here, and I'm here with Jared, longtime subscriber. He's actually becoming a friend of mine now, which is funny. Yeah. So, how long have you watched the channel for? Three years. Three years? That long? Holy moly, every single video. He's got the PC merch on, and uh, yeah, he actually helped me with my parents' backyard remodel a little while back. And uh, ever since then, you know, we've been talking, hanging out sometimes. But you've been a subscriber for three years now. Yeah. And today, I'm gonna let you just literally walk down the aisles and pick a fish. And once you pick the fish, like pick anything you want, once you pick the fish, we have to then find where we would put it. And then if it works, then we buy it. If not, then I'm obviously not gonna buy something I'm not prepared for. In this case, Jared, start searching. Now these could do. I do like the spotted ones. Um, nah. <laughs> There's a red tail under that rock. You can see him right there. Got another little peacock up here. This is exactly where I got my peacock. Bunch of cichlids, and then over here, blue lobster. Look at him in the back. See him right there? That's that's like, I would buy that in a second. I'd oh, say yeah. one of those. You mean, that was a quick decision. This? One of these big the old goldfish. Huh? The one right here with the white. This one? Yeah. That is a really cool looking fish, so we'll keep that in mind. Let's keep walking, see if we find anything else. Don't forget, Jared, there's not only this tank, there's saltwater stuff behind you. We also have saltwater tanks, so. Pink one. You like the pink one? Yeah. That one? Dude, you know, that would be really good in my parents' pond. Yeah. That's like a Midas. That's, I mean, I think it is a Midas, actually. Dang, so you, you, you're picking good stuff already. We have this guy right here, and then we also have, that Jared picked, one of these Aranda goldfish right here. Aranda, Aranda, 
who knows. Now you have uh, a lot to choose from, so. You're gonna make me go broke, all right? So slow down a little bit, <laughs> take it easy. It's a dead arowana. That sucks, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's just the core. It is? Yeah. <laughs> I did the same thing to my mom, actually. Recap. Isn't that insane? Yeah, what is that called again? It's a Cora Llama. I want him. The Cora Llama? Yeah. Yeah. That's actually a decor. It's fake. Oh, you dumb. <laughs> it looks, it yeah, it's does. fake. It, it looks so real. It and really It does. gets every single person. It actually does. It gets everyone every time. Over here, we have a lot of, like, smaller stuff. Not that we can't do that, but I, mean, I don't really have many places to put those. Want a pet rat? I have a rabbit already. <laughs> Look at this fish. That looks coral. familiar. Bunch of puffers, trigger fish. Can't get those because, you know, we have coral. So that's unfortunate. You know what we could get is turtles. Want to go over there? Look at this. Look at the eels. Ooh, Look, the eel. he squeezed his way through. He literally squeezed through the centerpiece. I like the white one. The white one is cool. But I think all these eat fish. I have one mantis shrimp tank, and then I have the other tank with corals and fish, and these will probably eat the fish. And the one at the other house, the farmhouse, the big one, has that big eel. That yeah. will probably do some damage to those little eels, so yeah. I'll have to stay away from those. Look, it's a baby version. That's the baby version of the one I have. Over here at the turtles now. Yeah, let's do some turtles. He wants to do turtles. I promise I'm not telling him this stuff off camera. I told him there was turtles available. I never said you had to get them, did I? Nope. I'm trying to think of what my turtle used to look like. If you guys want to see me do this again as well, although like, yes, he's a subscriber, a long time subscriber. We only hung out like what, three times? This is the first time we've ever filmed together. I will pick one of you watching right now to come and do this. Whether you, Wherever you live, I'll fly out, but I got to see 30,000 likes on this video. 30,000 likes and I will somehow in one of these different videos, I'll find someone other than Jared. I, although I love you, Jared. <laughs> thanks for subscribing, thanks for supporting. But when I want to do this again with someone else. So, like the video. Oh, he just tumbled down. He took a fall. Yeah. Two turtles? Yeah. Two turtles? Yeah. Two? Yeah. All right. Hey, listen, I'm not making the decisions here. What do you want? Which ones? Uh, it would be the one right there on the rock. Yeah, with that jagged back end right there? Yeah. That looks and cool. And the one next to it. Okay, so two of them. There's a painted back there too. All right, let's get someone to purchase the two turtles and the two fish. Oh, chameleon. That's cool. I've always wanted to do a chameleon tank. Tommy, the aquarium guy, has actually been just begging me to make an outdoor enclosure. Look at this. We got, so we got this one right here. We got that one, Knuckles. And then we got this over here, this white one right there, which I... Did not know these are $50. $50. What are you doing to me, man? <laughs> That's expensive little goldfish right there. Yeah. So we got that, this guy right here, and what? Two turtles. Two tur oh, two turtles. Right there, two of the turtles in here. We could put them inside the turtle tank, the turtle tub, the 120 yeah. gallon. Look at him. I mean, that thing is just so cute. There he goes, taking a little breath. All right, let's get someone to check us out, man. Let's do this. We could do an yeah, albino. Like Look at him. What did you say? We could do an albino. Um. Yeah, yeah, we could <laughs> could do an albino or a musk, <laughs> musk turtle. Or that one, musk. So, super cool, better than albino. Let's just do the musk. I mean, it'd be better to do the albino realistically, but yeah, you have two of them already. I had two baby musks, but through the transport, I think they got eaten. All right, so we have a total of four things we're buying today: two fish and two turtles. Two plus two. Yeah. What's nine four. plus ten? Nineteen. Not what I was looking for, but all right. Perfect. Awesome. Right? Yep. Yeah, get, this actually was fun. <laughs> you got to come and just pick out a bunch of things. Watch, they're just going to get sucked up into space. Oh, almost got them. So close. I hope he's getting, then it's gone. What do you think? That's it. That's it. There's a little common goldfish in there with him. That thing will get huge. You know, that I think they call it like a three pounder. One that was three pounds. Common goldfish get a lot bigger than you think. Dude, they are micro. That's sick. Right? Yeah. There's a little silver arowana. Those are like freshly born. They like just getting rid of their little sack that's underneath them. Oh, there's a baby baby. That's a minnow. <laughs> that's a minnow. Oh yeah. That was that was pristine. That was easy. Oh. Oh yeah. Perfect. Yeah. All right, Jared, come on in, man. Nice lanyard, too. All right, turn all these lights on here. Bingo! Bingo, bingo, bingo! We got you a friend. Tiny has a new friend. It looks like a female. 
Um, we're not gonna assume here, but look, your new friend. You have a friend. I plan to get them a bigger aquarium uh, in the new fish room, fish building, I should say, 1,400 square foot building getting built at the new property. If that's some new news to you, you probably should go watch one of the other videos. Anyway, we have two turtles as well that you picked out. Yeah. You are gonna do all the honors of putting them in. So there they are, our two turtles. What is this one? This is the, look at that. Look at the colors. Such a cute little guy. And then we got a little tiny, look at how tiny. The size of like a fingernail mud turtle. Albino turtle, another albino one hanging out right there. They like never can really be seen. We also have four of these Indian spotted. There's one, there's another head popping out of the rock right there. You can see him. A bunch of uh, little painteds and yellow bellies that are growing so much. Where's the albino turtle? His head's sticking out of the sand somewhere. There he is. He's right underneath everyone. Can you guys, can you all move to the side so I can see my albino? There he is. There he is in the sand, albino soft shell. And of course we have our fish in here as well, the tetras and goldfish and stuff like that. Look at how big this yellow belly is. Oh, okay, but he's just huge. So all the other turtles are inside that rock. I mean, literally inside here. You wanna hold this real quick? I'm gonna show you the other turtles. They're all hiding so people, oh, there's, this, there's the pink belly. Oh, he's gone, he ran. Oh, he's right here, he's trying to get back in. Aha, check that out. Our little pink belly side neck has doubled in size. I mean, quite literally doubled in size already. And he's got his little hiding spot, so I'm just gonna let him go back. There's a couple more turtles inside there, but of course, they're hiding everywhere. I mean, it's a big old house to hide. You have a lot of spaces. All right, your turn. Going in. Here, what's his name? Craig. Craig. <laughs> that is Craig the turtle, picked by Jared. It is going in right now. Oh, you am gonna put him on there and let him run in. Oh, he ran right in. That is the first kind of that turtle. I believe it's like a, what is it, what was it called? Pennsylvania? I don't know what the heck it was called, but first species of that. And now mud turtle, we used to have two of these, but unfortunately throughout the process of moving into this bigger thing, both of them didn't make it, which is super weird for a turtle. I've never had that issue before. In this case we did, so we got another one. How tiny is he, dude? Look at how small, He's just a little baby. Oh my goodness. There you go, bud. And plop. Down he goes. Oh my gosh, he's so small. He Look at the size comparison. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my goodness. Look at him, so tiny. Cute little thing. Look What's that, that one's name? We'll let the Kaferos name him? Yeah. All right, we're gonna let you Kaferos name that little musk turtle there. Comment some names, let me know. Our pink belly is like sideways right there trying to bury himself. Albinos are vibing. Hey buddy. He's saying hi to us, you know? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna let you pop the bag open and just dump it right in. Let's turn the lights on. There we go. There you go, buddy. There you are. Your friend is right here, and you're both about, to, well, he's a little bigger than you, but. I love that white, dude. Good choice, yeah. good choice, good choice. I like that, and now he's got a friend. He didn't have a friend before. I mean, he did have some blue lobsters inside the hole, but he didn't have that type of friend. Oh, they're gonna be best friends, bro. Yeah. <laughs> lights off. You know where we go now? Mamas. Mamas. OG house, the OG backyard. Yep. Yup. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Before we go to the OG backyard, you guys wanted an update on the last video. We unboxed a bunch of super dangerous fish and I didn't really show them in the aquarium. So real quick, we're gonna jump over to Predatory Fins, show you those fish, and then we'll be at the backyard releasing our new fish that we got. I'm here with Rodrigo. Bro, perfect timing, bro, watch this. Ready? Oh my, he got it already? Did he eat? Yeah. He ate it. Oh! <laughs> Yo, that scared the sh That scared me. Look at these two. I don't think they, they go up though. They just stay on the bottom the whole time. Even the eel. The eel was eating like crazy today. Oh, the eel's in there, okay. We have these weird looking coral fish, scorpion fish. It looks literally like a piece of coral. Yep, they're pretty cool. Look at the size. If you're confused when I'm showing you, one of my last videos, we were unboxing a bunch of dangerous creatures. They all live. They're, they all live? All live. All of them live. It was a delayed flight, but I ended up being at the airport. So I picked up a fish shipment for Rodrigo. They ended up being these dangerous fish. Like every single one of them are poisonous and dangerous. So it was a cool uh -huh. shipment. They got like arms. They're so, so cool. And y'all asked me to come back and film them in the tanks, in where they're at now. So this but, is uh, this is them. But tell them the real reason why we're here right now, somewhere yes. else, you know? So go ahead, tell The them. real reason why we're here is because Rodrigo and I, and Adam, have partnered to do a toy drive for children that don't have toys for Christmas. 
Sorry. Yes. So the plan is we actually have a moving truck who's not here today. We're gonna take that truck, load up with toys. We have to go buy a bunch of toys. We actually got a bunch of donations already on the website, redtoyfence.com, and all that money is gonna be towards toy. How much money are you putting in, bro? I'm gonna put a thousand bucks. I'll put a thousand bucks. Thousand bucks each. And every sale that we have, every hundred dollars we sell, money is gonna go towards the gifts. Any sale on his website for the fish, a portion of it we give in towards the toy drive. I'll donate a thousand, he'll donate a thousand. And if you guys wanna contribute and help out giving toys to kids you know that can't have Christmas presents, top link in the description and all the information's on the site, right? Yeah, we also have Tank Life Apparel. They made a t-shirt for us for this event. Yes. You guys wanna purchase is on the website, tanklifeapparel.com. And we're gonna wear that shirt too, dude. We so, will be wearing it once we get it. I don't, we don't have them this, yet. Yes, Toy Drive, we collabed, we did this whole thing. Next year, we're gonna take it like a lot more serious. This year was last minute, but we wanted to somehow help out. So next year will be even bigger, but this year, if you wanna contribute, link's in the description. Now, the other saltwater fish that you're looking for is over there. This is the other stuff, the shark, the stingray, super cool. They're actually hugging each other right now. The shark, of course, was right here the whole time. Now it wants to swim around. Look at that. Sleeping doll, I'm blinded by the light. So it's cloudy because I put a bunch of uh, crushed coral. We know we're moving, so I want to have a little bit of Look at him. something to enjoy while that we're here. That is so cool. And I didn't want to leave him in the basket, you know what I mean? Yeah. And then you got the stingray right there. The other stingray I already sent to a friend of mine. Really? Yeah. Oh, cool. Well, look at that. We're gonna, we're gonna be getting some good stuff in there, bro. What about you? When are you gonna ah, get? Ah, I want a shark. That's what I want. I want that. That is so cool. Look at me coming up. What about that white grouper? Oh my goodness. That might be the coolest fish I've ever seen. You like getting pet? Look at all the grouper coming out. Emperor snapper. Oh my goodness. Woo! Woo! -hoo. That grouper is massive. And then the eel comes, and this thing just freaks me out. So freaking scary. Look at that thing. Your dog just took a pee right there. Dude, hey. On, Tank, do you not have like... Look, there's a female right here, bro, and that's what you do? I'm gonna sell him. <laughs> Guys, you know we gotta check. We gotta check up on the monster. Hey, buddy. Watch this, ready? Woo! I didn't even go near him and he did that. My camera is soaked. Oh, my camera is probably broken. Oh my gosh, the thing soaked my camera. So yes, here they are. These are the fish we unboxed. You already saw the shark, the stingray. I believe we had just these after that. And then of course, we unboxed a bunch of catfish. Where are the little hybrids? Oh, here. There's the bichers, all of them laying on the bottom. And then the catfish, all the little hybrid catfish are right here. And there they are, laid up, hanging out with Oscars. Right. I, honestly, that 30 minutes that you had to drive there might have made a difference. Yeah. We, as a Cafero, as a team, picked up early. Could have saved some fish's lives. And now, I charge you. So there you go, Caferos. You saw everything we unbagged. And uh, yeah, on with the video. Get a handful of food. Here's the Oscars. Hey, buddies. Here, take some, eat some. A little bit over here for all my minnow friends and mollies and platties. Lots of mollies and platties up in there. Now the beautifully grassed backyard. Look at that, all grass. That's where the dogs pee. Um, but yeah, all grass. Look at the turtles and koi right there. Look at our turtles. We got the albinos. We have all of our koi fish back there that we got. Everyone's eating right now. So many minnows. There's just hundreds and hundreds of minnows. See all those minnows in there? Oh, there's a little yellow belly. Look how beautiful this is back here though. I mean, so natural. The water just coming straight down right into this beautiful pond. Can't beat this, right? Nope. I mean, that's just a crazy, crazy backyard. This is where it all started, though. I dug the first pond in that corner right there, and it led me to having 30 pigs somehow. This pond right here is where we're going to put what is in this box. Y'all know what's in the box. Uh, it's actually a Midas cichlid, and it'll get along with the Oscars here because they, they are both predatory fish by my finger. Oh golly, he actually did. You can see the Oscars are in here. They like to be on this side, although they could swim under the bridge and come over to the deeper side over here. But yes, do your thing, Jared. This is all you, man. See what happens when you subscribe to the channel? You could possibly be getting fish for my ponds. Just make sure you get your palm wet before you grab the fish. It's gonna be awesome. There you go. Let's see it. Wow. Look at that fish. So pretty. There he goes, Jared! Woo! Yup. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Is that your uh, keyword? Yeah. He's hiding under the lily pads right now. Oh, well, 
Hey, listen, I can move lily pads. Look, he's in there. See him in there? He's hiding up in there. Those lily pads are thriving. Yeah, they are. Ah, oh, you said something different that time. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the Oscar and him vibing. They're checking each other out. Ugh. Thanks for coming over, man. Yeah. yeah, being a subscriber of the channel. This is what you can do if you subscribe. Just hit that subscribe button. Like I said, if this gets enough likes, smash that like button, 50,000, 60,000 likes, and I will fly or find someone local, whatever it may be, get another subscriber and do something similar to this again, or maybe even a higher scale. Without further ado, here at the OG Backyard, thank you so much for watching. Check out the merch, top link in the description, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.